me and my buddy Rob were having a smoke at the library in the sun, and we said, you know, we got to get out of the sun. We're going to get skin cancer. <laughs> We move off into the shade, watch the girls walking by. And they're walking, they get showing off that beautiful cleavage. Nice. Girls are like wearing underwear to school, it's great. <laughs> I just want to say, on behalf of all the other 47 year old fat, bald headed guys, gray hair, got no more game. <laughs> Thanks, ladies, for getting my job. Half of every one of those guys. That's all we got left is what we can put in the spank bank. Oh, we got it. These girls, they're walking around half naked. Half naked! Women walking around campus half naked. You know, and they got their thongs. You have you know the thongs, the ones I mean? They got their thongs halfway up their backs. <laughs> and they curl. I love it. Love it. Dirty old man. Turn into. Hey, they're going to show it off. This one, I've, I've walked, you know, one girl walked by the library one time, and I was this. <laughs> you know, like she grew up in Denver or something. <laughs> <laughs> she walked, she caught me. She walks over, she says, you know, that's inappropriate. And I said, well, you know, I was just thinking the exact same thing. <laughs> Your underwear on, geez. Yes. Your thong halfway up your back. You know, some women they don't have their thongs halfway up their backs. I think to myself sometimes, these women that don't have their thongs halfway up their back, their thong straps must be down around here somewhere. Really, you know, like where are their thong straps? They don't all have it. Yeah. So I put together this little thing that I'm test marketing and I'm trying to get opinions of people to help those women get those thong straps up. Call it thong spenders. Oh. <laughs> and I just want to get your guys' opinion. Check these out. Thong spenders, ladies and gentlemen. I bet you I could probably go into any bar tonight and pick up any guy I want for you. <laughs> 